Uh, how's it going uh, Isaac? Uh, Stephen, how, how are you guys doing? Good. Oh, doing great. How are you? Yeah, yeah, pretty good. Uh, you know, congrats on Minari. Um, I watched it at uh, Glasgow Film Festival, uh, where it got its UK premiere. Um, it's, you know, a touching film, incredibly funny in parts as well. Um, for you, Isaac, it's, you know, a, a personal uh, story. How much of an, uh, a, an emotional journey was it for you, you know, to, to make this? Uh, it, it, it was quite an emotional journey that I wasn't quite prepared or expected <laughs> to, 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 for it to be that emotional. Um, you know, we, we had very little time to make this film and our budget was quite small. So I was thinking about the weather and all these different obstacles that we would face when we get onto set, but I wasn't prepared for um, just how much I would be feeling um, as, as I'm doing the work. Uh, and, and that can, I mean, that feels like that'd be a good thing when you're directing a film, because obviously films are emotional things. But when you're directing, it's also quite a professional uh, work of just trying to be a project manager in some sense. So um, that, that would creep in and get in the way. And um, it, it's something that I just had to wrestle with and uh, find a balance for, find a way to channel it uh, in, in a proper way. Um, so yeah, this this was a very emotional film for me. Um, and, and I've been glad that people are connecting to it on that level. That's kind of what I was hoping with it. Yeah. Uh, and for you, Stephen, um, you know, when you got the script, uh, what was it that really, you know, grabbed you uh, and made you think, I need to do this film? Um, I think it was, for me, what really grabbed me was just um, how true it read. How, how, how honest it read to me. Um, it, it wasn't my experience specifically, but it was also so something I could deeply connect with. And um, to read something like that um, on multiple levels is, is really rewarding and, and refreshing. And so, uh, yeah, I, I, I'm blessed to experience this. And you've got, you know, that background in improv, you know, that's kind of where you got your, your start. Um, how much did that help you at all uh, in this film? Were you able to, you know, try and ad lib or, you know, add your own, you know, spin on it even more? Yeah, you know, Isaac, Isaac created an environment, um, you know, to me, like masterful directing is less about um, moving pieces around uh, in meticulous ways and more about, I think, creating an environment where all your characters can thrive and, and be honest and truthful and free. And Isaac is a masterful director that way. And he really can created situations where um, he wasn't asking for something specific, but he was just um, capturing what was happening. And um, there's many moments. I think a lot of my, ex a lot of Jacob's exchanges with Paul were, were improvised. Um, that dynamic, that energy was um, something that Will and I just naturally fell into. And that was really wonderful because he's such a phenomenal actor as well. Um, and, uh, you know, also, uh, you know, there's that really great shot that Isaac snagged of, of, of Jacob smoking and praying in, in, uh, by himself. And that was unplanned. And that was just us kind of being around each other and submitting to energy and um, being open to capturing things like that. Lockie, uh, Lachlan, our, our, our DP, was also so instrumental in being able to pivot and find things that we weren't necessarily asking for. And I need to ask, you know, Alan Kim is arguably, you know, the, the standout star uh, in this film. Uh, for you, Stephen, did you ever imagine that you would be, you know, competing with a, a seven-year-old um, at the oh, time? I'm not competing. Nobody's competing. Uh, <laughs> there's no I think for, it, it makes sense. You know, Alan is such a star that kid, he's, he's, he's a really wonderful person and so talented um i think for me you know the larger thing um in the way that we view it is this is a really shared experience this is a collective experience and um every individual i think is being serviced by it in their own unique way and it's meeting them there and what a way for um the world to know the next generation of talent in someone like him and i'm glad that people are getting to know him and for you, Isaac, sorry, um, you know, when you were doing the, the casting, did you know from pretty early on that Alan was going to be, you know, your, your guy to play David? 
I, I knew he was very special and he, he stood out from everybody um, from the very beginning, but I was very worried because he was only seven years old. He was the youngest of all of our submissions. And I intentionally said, let's look for somebody who's at least like eight or nine, because uh, that he would be easier to direct and we'd have more time with him on set because of child labor laws. Um, but I just kept coming back to Alan because I mean, he, there's something now you're, you're a witness to it and there's something so special about him. And we brought Steven down for an audition uh, to, to help with an audition of Alan and um, their dynamic together was so good that we were all convinced let's, let's fight for this because uh, this is going to make the film very special. And just one final question uh, for you both, you know, before you go, you know, there's been the Golden Globe win, uh, BAFTA nominations. Do you guys pay much attention to the award season or are you just happy for the film to get that level uh, of exposure? I, to, to answer your question, I guess um, it's a mixture of both. Um, all, all my cousins are in this group chat and they will constantly be reminding me what's important, what award matters and all this stuff. So, so it's, it's inescapable, um, but it's, it's been a wild ride and we're just grateful. Uh, well, it's been a uh, great chat with you guys. You know, best luck with the, the movies uh, releasing. Thanks for all your time, okay? Thanks. Yeah, thank you, Thomas. Take it easy. Ladies and gentlemen, you're watching Hey You Guys! Hey You Guys, huh? Hey you guys, Is that yeah. from the Goonies? It is indeed, yeah. Nice. Hey! hey.